Well, I thought I'd do an unboxing of this, the HEO Solutions, um, the Ducato and Peugeot Boxer Citroen Jumper uh, <laughs> uh, cab door lock. So this is the sort of driving cab door lock. Um, now, they were very kind over at the uh, dealers. I didn't know whether this was one lock or two locks in here so they opened the box for me at um, Caravana Sangars in uh, La Manga these cost 165 euros and 25 cents which is about it's about right for the sort of list price which I thought was uh, was quite good because you can see dealers marking these up quite a bit, but here it is. Um, it comes in a just an ordinary cardboard box. There's um, that oh you get some stickers to put on the on the door, and these these are uh, HEO HEO safe secured door stickers. So you get one for each door. Um, and they look like that so it says that you can stick them on the inside or or the outside but I think I'll be sticking those on the inside of the window um, one for each door there there's a looks like a warning leaflet I don't know quite what that says uh, there's probably an English version on here somewhere let's see uh, yeah make sure make sure that when the door is open playful children or the bolt of the door locks do not accidentally activate so yeah so don't sort of shut the door with the locks in the lock position there's uh, good contact information here for the HEO solutions and pretty good uh, little fold out instruction leaflet these are the templates so there's a left and right hand door template to uh, so you, you cut these out and place them on the on the door to allow you to cut around so it's like this you get these you know it's on it's on the back of there so you get these and these line up and then you cut around with a little Dremel or other type of saw um, to cut the remis blinds uh, to fit so good in good quite good instructions in four languages one of them being English and then you get the two locks now when I got I got one of these out earlier and I thought oh no I haven't put any keys in so that's the that's the lock as you see it so that's the that's the bit that goes against the door frame and you can use them with or without a key and this go this screws onto the um, the armrest section so but I thought oh no there's no keys but then the other one had all four keys in so these keys it, it, there's four keys and they're all all the same effectively so key goes in locks and you then can't uh, lock it turn that around lock but that's in the lock position so if that was on the door this is the passenger door uh, side that would be the frame there so you can't pull that over and you can't turn it but just unlock it there sorry I've locked it there so lock it there you can't turn it unless you push it in so it needs to be pushed in slightly to turn it and unlock it so you can't it doesn't it won't easily accidentally lock you have to actually make a real push in against the spring so locked and then secured with the key 
there's no way that that can be unlocked which is quite good and I think this will this will fit onto the um, onto the door but we do need to cut around the remis blind to fit this uh, bit here so you get the um, the two locks the four keys and some other bits here these bits are to go on the on the door frame so that that will actually fit in there I think it I think it goes, well, I'm not quite sure which way round that goes probably that way um, so that's you know that's going to do that and there's a couple of screw holes there we might have to do some drilling they're sort of shaped like that so I think that's you know that's going to be pretty pretty secure so there's a couple of those um, that lock there and then the the opposite like so so they're both they're both the same but they go on different doors so one for the driver's door one for the passenger door like that and then you've got these bits and some extra screws because so I think what you need to do I haven't fully read the instructions but what you need to do is take these off and this top cover comes off and then the body um, is sort of screwed on through there uh, so you come through through the back of there there's a little hole I don't know if you can see it there's a little hole screw hole just there that uh, you put one of those allen bolts through into the existing um, door cover um, screw hole so that's what you get with the HEO South HEO safe um, Fiat Ducato door locks I think they feel I mean they feel really really sturdy uh, a really good product I think and good as I say very good instructions with little pictures all along and quite detailed they do actually fold right out that's that's what they look like when they're when they're finished and as I say there's sort of instructions these are the these are the other bits that I showed you this bit here of how to fit those onto the door frame and then there's you know the remis blind cutouts as well they're really really good um, I'm so happy that I managed to find them in a dealership. Anyway, that's it from me today. Hope you've enjoyed that. Give us a thumbs up if you've liked that. I am going to make a video of um, me actually fitting these, or at least fitting one of them. Probably I'll make a video of me fitting the second one um, <laughs> so that I can practice a little bit and um, that you'll get, to, you'll get to see how it all works. So as I say, give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and click the ding dong bell icon so that we can send you reminders for whenever we upload a new video. I'll see you again soon and more securely with the HEO safe door locks. Bye for now.